Bree and Jason, it was one of the most controversial pieces of legislation that became law last year, giving elected officials a 40% wage hike less than one month after the general election. The law was passed in November during a special session called by Lieutenant Governor Ray Tenorio. The session was held to vote on salary increases for appointed and elected officials relative to income levels set by the Competitive Wage Act of 2014. During this session, senators voted 10 to 1 to raise their salaries from 65000 to 85000 annually, a salary increase retroactive to January 2014. It was signed into law by Tenorio just hours later. Public outcry immediately followed with many upset that the law was passed without a public hearing. Legislators cited past public hearings on the Competitive Wage Act as justification. Students from Simon Sanchez High School's Advanced Placement Government class are delving into the issue this quarter. They interviewed more than 1,200 registered voters to gauge the opinions on the legislation. Of the 1,243 registered voters surveyed, 76% reported they did not agree with the raises legislators passed. 23%, however, did agree with the raises, while 1% was unsure. Of those that disagreed with the raises, 100% disagree with the fact that there was no public hearing. 26% disagree with the fact that it was paid retroactively. 10% disagreed with the amount of the salary increase, while 69% disagreed with all of the above. So do voters feel the law should be repealed? Of the 874 participants asked this question, 91% responded yes. Senator Mike Sinicholas has been the law's biggest critic and attempted to repeal the raises last year. His effort was thwarted by an amendment by Senator Tommy Morrison with the support of eight other senators. The final question in the survey asked if participants would vote for legislators who supported the pay increases. 67% said no, 18% said yes, and 15% were unsure. AP government instructor Andre Bainham said, quote, the results of this survey may have negative political consequences for those elected officials who supported the passage of the hefty pay raises, end quote. Bainham said the goal of the survey was to show the applicability of theories learned in the classroom, as well as the importance of civic engagement and how participation can ultimately influence the decisions of government officials. Bainham added, while not a scientific study, students did follow a systematic sample survey method and worked in conjunction with the Simon Sanchez Math Department. Brian Jason, back to you.